Hi, I'm Lindsay and I blog at Fizzy Peaches. This is Violet, she is 11 months old and today we are going to be showing you the Ickle Bubba Stomp V4 travel system which we've been putting through its paces for the last couple of weeks. The Stomp V4 is a special edition travel system that comes in two colours which have both been inspired by nature. The Woodland Bronze is the one that we have which is a gorgeous green colour with a rose goldy bronze chassis which is really eye catching. You can also get it in blueberry chrome too. So I'll start off by showing you the carry cot feature. This is suitable from birth and goes right up to six months. It's such a shame because we haven't been able to use this with Violet as she's now 11 months old, but it's so pretty. As you can see, there is so much attention to detail throughout the whole travel system and it has a really luxurious feel with the leatherette bumpers, um, the colour, the rose gold chassis. It's really lovely. So the carry cot part has got a lined hood, which I'm just showing you here, which is UV protected so your little one is safe away from harmful rays of the sun. Inside, it's fully quilted with a luxury liner, which is so, so soft. I'm just taking the cover off and inside you'll see it is the softest pram carry cot that I think I've ever tried out. I also really like the harness that they've got there because you can keep your baby nice and secure. The brake system couldn't be easier, it's just that bar that you push and pull up so it's really easy to access if you're in a hurry, if you need to stop suddenly, you just can't miss it. There are lots of different positions for the handle to be in so you can adjust it so it's really comfortable for you. It's especially good if you're tall, I'm not particularly myself, but it does go up very high. As you can see underneath there's a really large basket which has got a firm base so you can put your shopping in there and it's not going to fall out. The travel system comes with an Ickle Bubba change bag which is a really thoughtful touch. It's really handy as you can put it either on the handles or in the basket below. There's a pocket there which you can put your phone in or your purse so you can grab them easily. And here's a sneak peek into my change bag. I've packed a few nappies, wipes, a toy and there's also a change mat which came included with the bag. The main part we've been using is the stroller setting. This is us out and about and you can see that Violet's really enjoying trying out her new wheels. So just to give you a bit more of an overview of the stroller part, you can see that one of the things I really really loved about it is it's got a really large hood that comes right over so they're shaded from the sun. I found other prams just don't have that. We've got the foot muff or cosy toes which is quite tight, that's the one thing that I'd say it was quite difficult to get on and off to start with but I think it's going to loosen up over time and inside there's a really really comfy seat which actually comes with a seat liner you can see in there, that's inside the cosy toes, I think we'd need to use an extra blanket to keep her really warm on a cold day the stroller has a really really safe five way harness system so your little one has no way of escaping so I've popped her in and the straps are all fully adjustable so it can grow with your little one and I'm just checking that they're all tight enough to hold her in safely and they've got lovely padded bits around the shoulders so they're really comfortable too. And off we go again. One thing I noticed with the travel system is where we live has lots of cobbles. We live in a little village and uh, it's got amazing suspension. The wheels, it's a four wheeler and they are super bouncy which means it's a super smooth ride for Violet. Also for added safety it's got front brakes so I'm just clipping them on now as well. The stroller part as well as sitting up it does go back into a recline so if your little one's tired you can pop them back so that they can have a snooze along the way. You can also change the stroller part so it's either facing you if your child prefers that which Violet does or face them out to the world if they prefer a look around. So now we're home, I will show you how to fold up the stroller and take it apart. So I've taken the stroller part off and just with two simple clicks it goes down and that will fit in the boot of any car and you can just undo it, which I found a bit tricky to start with as you can see, but it pops straight back up. On to the last part of the travel system which is the car seat and it's got to be one of the most comfortable car seats I've ever seen as it has so much padding it looks super comfy. It's got a five point safety harness, again with the padded shoulders and it's got this lovely warm foot muff. It's suitable from birth to 13 kilos so you'll get lots of use out of it and you can connect it to the travel system using these connectors. It also is ISOFIX suitable and the base comes included with the travel system too so that just means you can pop it in and out of the car at a click of a button. It is so, so easy and I'd highly recommend using the ISOFIX base. 
in all, it's been a big thumbs up for us. <coughs> oh, bless you. <laughs> We've loved using our Ickle Bubba Stomp V4 and taking it out for a test run, and we're going to continue using it for the next months to come. Um, I'd say the only slight negatives, which wouldn't put us off, but um, were a little bit tricky, were that it was quite difficult to put together. I found the instruction booklet not the easiest to understand. The images are quite dark, so you can't really see which parts go where, so it was a lot of guesswork. And the second thing is, is that some of the clips are not very self-explanatory and they're quite stiff, so you can't really work out how to take bits apart easily. So in the pouring rain, when you're in the car park trying to fold it down, I have found it a little bit tricky, but once I mastered it, I've been okay. But it did take a little bit longer than other prams because it's not as self-explanatory. But they're really minor details. Once you've got the gist, then you'll be fine. So this was our whistle stop tour of the Ickle Bubba Stomp V4 travel system. If you've enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to Netmums. Thanks for watching.